cancer has impacted uh, a ton of people in, in my family, a ton of people in this world. Being in, in this profession, you never want to take for granted the days, the time that you have impacting people's lives. When cancer gets in, in the way of it, it takes away from the impact that you can have. So we really want to make sure that we can do anything that we can to help derail this this ugly disease. Some of these guys that, that uh, are out there on, on the court are going through some things that maybe don't show up. You know, you watch them on TV, but you don't know what's going on in their lives. And, and cancer is such a big part of our society and it's hurt and impacted so many people that I think as coaches and players, there are things like that that are going on in our lives that, that not everybody can see. Those guys are people, they have personal lives and they're they may be going through some stuff. And so the more we can get that message out and get people to get checkups and, and uh, make sure that everything is going well in their lives, I think that's a good thing. Cancer affects everybody. It doesn't play favorites. Great athletes still get cancer. Young coaches still get cancer. It affects everybody's life. It, it really brings a human part of, of basketball. Cancer is something that touches all of us eventually one way or another. And I think our role in this and, and Coaches Versus Cancer uh, does a tremendous job, you know, amplifying the message, bringing awareness. Last August 10th, I lost my father to lung cancer. And I think when we have the suits and sneakers that every coach wears suits to make a huge point about raising awareness and money for cancer.